Hey everyone, today is question and answer day. Yay! So, question and answers are not always about real estate, they're just about all sorts of topics. So, today's question is something that I get asked all the time. No matter where I am or what I'm doing, I will get asked this at least once a day, which is fine. I get it, I'm different, but yeah. So, Today's question is, where am I from? I am from New Zealand. It's a beautiful country and it is not attached to Australia like some people think. It is not part of Australia in any way. It is its own country. We are like annoying cousins to each other. So, especially when you come down to sports. Uh-uh not related at all. Besides that, okay, New Zealand has a population of just under 5 million people, which is pretty awesome. I think that kind of like is the perfect number. I am from Gisborne. Well, I was born in Gisborne, which has a population of just over 30,000 people, which is awesome because it's not that big. But it has amazing beaches, it has really good fishing, and really good farming. Uh, it also has the largest Māori population. The people that identify as Māoris in Gisborne is 48.9%, whereas the national average is 14.9%, so a big difference. And for those of you that don't know, Māori is the native people to New Zealand. I personally am one sixteenth Māori and my tribe that my family belong to is the Ngāti Puru tribe, which is on my father's side. My mother is from London. So yeah, quite a mixture there. And in this picture here is my great, 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 great grandmother. I think that's right. Maybe one more great. I'm not too sure. But yeah, it's pretty awesome. So growing up, uh, up until we moved to America, I moved give or take 32 times. While I was younger, we moved around Gisborne, Wairoa and Rotorua, which is all kind of on the east coast of the North Island. And then when I was a little bit older, maybe like 10 or 9, we moved to Auckland and that's pretty much where we stayed. We stayed on the north shore of Auckland. Auckland is broken up into many areas and yeah, we were on in the north shore. And yeah, that's where we pretty much stayed. Now, I don't know if I mentioned, but Auckland has a population of one point six million people, which is rather a lot of people for one city, but it's a quite spread out city and it has most of the main businesses are there, the top universities. Yeah, it's just an amazing city to be in. Uh, also, they have international cruise liners that come there and it has a really busy international airport which is fantastic because it means you can get anywhere in the world from little tiny New Zealand. Yay. Now, as you know, New Zealand, generally you re relate New Zealanders to sheep. It's just what it is. There's more sheep in New Zealand than there are people because sheep farming is really uh, popular and the land is perfect for it. Now, before we moved here to America, we had a little farm, kind of a lifestyle farm. It was just over 11 acres. It backed onto the forest and we had a stream, we had a pond, it was beautiful. We also had sheep and cows and chickens and pigs. And I also designed up and planted a full, um, garden that had enough fruit trees, 
vegetable plots and uh, like avocado trees and all that sort of stuff. So our farm, just before we left, was pretty much fully self-sustainable. We had meat, eggs, fruit, and veggies. We were set. But then we had the opportunity to move and we thought, why not? So we sold the farm and moved here to America in 2014. And we've loved it here. It's been fantastic. We've loved it so much that on the 18th of November in 2019, I became an American citizen, which I think is a pretty big deal because there's a lot of stuff you've got to go through and tests and all of that sort of stuff. And I don't really like tests. So yeah, I was pretty nervous, but aced it. And yeah, now I'm American, yay. So that's me in a nutshell. I'm from New Zealand. I grew up in New Zealand. All of my family is in New Zealand. We knew no one when we moved to America. We have no family here, but we still thought, why not? We can always go back to New Zealand. It's just a plane ride. It's just like 16 hours out of your life to get there. So it's not that bad. It's definitely doable and we love it here. So another video, I'm gonna go over the details as to how we chose Utah and how we chose Salt Lake City and how we chose the suburb that we're in, which is kind of a unique story and we get asked all the time. So yeah, next time or another time, that's what I'll be doing a talk about. But I hope you've enjoyed my talk about New Zealand. If you have any questions whatsoever, whether it's about New Zealand, me, real estate, Sandy, Utah, Salt Lake City, please feel free to reach out to me. Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, email me. The details are all out there. I am easy to talk to and yeah, I look forward to catching you guys next time. Until then, be fantastic and I will spot you next time.